Hello world, I'm a cop welcome back to UFO Enemy Unknown where well we're basically in a situation where we're waiting for the aliens to build a base somewhere so that we can go there and capture a commander because uh our two top psychic guys are starting to be really really good. Like seriously. There's uh, like they can mind control aliens easily right now. It's just awesome. So awesome! I love using that mind control. Okay, I sent some power suits from uh, Antarctica to other places. Okay, alien retaliation in Siberia, very small. Uh, let's just go shoot it down from the sky. No, not with the Sky Ranger. No, not with the Sky Ranger. Damn it. Let's use the interceptor just to make sure we catch it. And uh, let's just, because it was a very small scout, so it's just gonna be destroyed. Yep, destroyed. Okay, and uh, let's just have time pass. Yeah, you're supposed to be going home. General stores are ready, so that must mean that they're ready in all the places so that I can actually destroy the uh, large... Uh... Hey, medium scout. A medium-sized scout vessel that poses little threat to Earth forces normally appears before larger vessels during missions. Yes, yeah, so I can destroy the... Uh, blah, 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 what are they? Radars. Radars, yeah, because we don't need regular radars when we have the... Uh, what is it called? Hyper-ray decoder. Yep, hyper-ray decoder. Do we have any more engineers here? Nope. Uh, well, let's uh, interrogate the navigator then. Everyone there. Right, and five seconds, yes, because uh, we build the, yeah, we build the, these things so we can just destroy this radar system here. Hey, this looks like a very good setup for a base, actually. Uh, destroy this radar, and let's destroy this radar. Okay, so now our bases are actually properly defensible. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Hey, how long does it take for us to build the, the, the Avenger? Ooh, two days! Right on, right on, right on. This is awesome. In an infiltration in North America. Yeah, we're gonna let that go through, cause uh, we want them to infiltrate and we want them to build a base. An Avenger is complete at Europe. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Can I put the Avenger? Oh, I have the fusion balls. <laughs> No, 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 let's not put the fusion balls in there. Uh, so we're gonna start using the Avenger instead of the Sky Ranger, so let's just take everyone out of the Sky Ranger. Okay, the Sky Ranger is empty. I actually had to transfer some stuff away from our base here in Europe to Australasia so that I could actually get everything out from the Sky Ranger. But now we're gonna put all of it into the Avenger. So first of all, we're gonna put two of these hover tanks here. We can put four, which is what we really want. Okay, so we can fit 14 heavy plasma with clips and all of this stuff, and we can't fit the electro flares then. Which is something we really, 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 really need, for instance, if we go to a base. So, we need to think, that's what we really need to think about, what do we need for an actual base attack. Right now we have weapons for 16, actually 17 guys. No, we don't need that many proximity grenades. I like hardly ever use them. And then when I, but it's always a thing that when I want to use them, I never have them with me. Okay, let's put the heavy. So right now we have 18 weapons here for 18 people. Two of them will have the small launcher. One of them will have the blaster launcher. And uh, yeah, I think that's fine. Let's just see how many more proximity grenades we can. Fit. No, no, it's not. we need to put the electro flares because the electro flares are a must have. But uh, to be perfectly honest, we can pick up and throw the electro flares, so four will probably be enough, and that would mean we can fit in five proximity grenades. Uh, let's take a couple of smoke grenades out of there and put proximity grenades instead. And yeah, I th so now we can fit 18 guys in here. Do we have 18 guys we want to fit in here? I don't want to put the guys who are in training at this moment onto the field, like, at all. So we can fit... How many guys is that? I think it's just 10 guys. 2, 
four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, ten guys and two tanks. So let's not actually take these extra heavy plasmas right now, and uh, let's not take the small launchers right now. But I just needed to check what we can get there. So first of all, we want to build two more hava tanks here. That is for sure. We also need to build weapons for the Avenger because it can uh, shoot things down on its own, so... Okay, let's start with that. Let's manufacture two plasma beams. Yeah, that's gonna take 12 hours, that's good. And we're gonna transfer... Oh, we don't have extra hangar anymore, anywhere. But then again, do we need a third Sky Ranger at all? Like, have we ever had a situation where we would have needed three teams? No, I don't think so, so we're just gonna sell the Sky Ranger. Sky Ranger worth nothing. Why is it worth nothing? Because oh, we're renting it basically, I think. Yeah, let's just sell that away and then uh, I'll check, because this is something I want to check a long time ago, is if we start building more of these, we're gonna need uh, 10 power sources and 10 navigation and if we're gonna build four more of these, so a, a total I'm gonna need 20 power sources and 20 navigation. Okay, that means that I am going to sell all... No, not in South America, they're all in Australasia. I'm gonna sell all the extra power sources and navigations I have. What, what, what was it? 20 and 20. That's gonna give us quite a lot of money. Yeah. Okay, so we should be good for the next... Uh, uh, the next monthly change. Yeah, this is stuff I have to send to Australasia to make some space for the stuff that we need to take out of the Sky Ranger. Okay, let's equip... No, not build anything. Let's equip... Let's equip the Avenger with the plasma beams. Plasma beams. And... Uh, you know what? We could send... more guys in here. So that we could put more guys on the team. Then again, 10 guys and 4 heavy weapon platforms is basically the best situation. Okay, so alien retaliation mission. If XCOM interceptors are being particularly successful in shooting down at UFOs, then the aliens may take some retaliatory action. This could result in a direct attack against an XCOM base. However, the aliens have to find an XCOM base in order to attack it, and provided UFOs are kept away, then there should be little danger of an assault. Right, right, right. That was uh, Navigator, wasn't it? I think we just researched. So let's research uh, this Navigator then. And... Uh, oh no! Oh no, no, no. So that's an alien retaliation at Pacific and it's heading right there. I'm pretty sure that's just heading right to the base. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do in this mission, this episode then. And probably in the next one too, so let's just make sure that Pacific has exactly the things it needs. Okay, we have 20 dudes here. They're all rookies. None of them have uh, armor, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, let's look at the stuff we have here. We have 20 heavy plasma, we have 20 clips for the heavy plasma, we have 4 blaster launchers and 13 blaster bombs. 8 alien grenades. So that is a total of 42, 46... 57, 65. Okay, so we shouldn't be bothered by the 80 item limit. Okay, so let's just, uh, because we're not gonna send anyone against it. It didn't come here? Where are you going? You're a battleship doing alien retaliation mission in the Pacific. How didn't you not, how did you not come to our base? Are you coming to our base now? Do, do you just not know where our base is? Dude! Wow! Well, I am surprised. Okay, let's just shoot this abductor down. Let's use a firestorm. Why not? Oh! No, 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 no. Let's use our Avenger. Because this is the true beauty of the Avenger. You can we send it to shoot down these ships. And that's over water, so let's wait a tiny bit just that we're not over water yes now we're not and then we're just gonna shoot it down 
and after it's been shut down, come on, we're gonna immediately start the mission. Yeah, begin mission, yes. Okay, the usual setup, Kenji gets the blaster, and uh, there's the abductor immediately over there. Why aren't you guys looking this way? Can't you see through the thing? Apparently not. Okay, so, 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 so. And I, of course, like, forgot to give some of my side. Took some... Ooh, there's an immediate person for mind control. Yeah, I took some more power armors into our European base, but I, of course, forgot to give them to anyone. And I'm... Also pretty sure that I forgot to put my guys manufacturing anything after they did the... Oh, there's another one. Yeah, after they did, did the, 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 the plasma beams for this thing. No, Kenji, not you. Uh, Uta. Yeah, Uta, mind control this one, please. Thank you. Okay, you look around a bit. Don't see anyone. Come here. And here. Can you look this way? Yes, you can. Yep. Thank you. Where's the other one? Over here. Uh, you can check out this corner. There are no aliens in the corner here. Okay, start coming this way. Right on. So it doesn't look like there is much aliens outside. Right, 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 right. Tank. Just come here. Oh! That's broken down. Huh, that's uh, actually not very good. Because uh, that means that they could be just coming out of there right here. And Well, then they're going to shoot our tank. And the tank is pretty armored. Whoa! That's tons of armor. I didn't even know they have that much armor. That's awesome. Okay, second tank. You come here and uh, you know what? Go up and head on top of the UFO, please. Okay, not enough time units. That's fine. Uh, Clarence Bernard. How are you guys set up right now? Because I thought Shuji would be closest to the door, but he's not, so it's Bernard and Clarence who are closest to the door. Right. Oh, okay, Shuji just came out. Prime that smoke grenade and drop it right there. And then let's have everyone just pile out. And, uh,. Yeah, because I'm worried that some aliens might come from here. I'm just going to leave this guy over here. I'm going to send someone like Bernard here. This way. To make sure that he's going to see the aliens next turn. Where's the other one? Okay, there's one and there's one. Okay, you should be able to see those guys next turn. Right. Sylvie just came out of there. Come on, Silly, out of there. And, uh, Brett, you come out of there. And head this way. Probably should have kept you a bit closer now that I think about it. Uh, Uta, step out of the way, so that's Otto. No, Otto, you go this way. Okay, Otto. Wait there, tank, you're done. Kenji, uh, wait for Sarah to get out of your way. Okay, Sarah, you wait there. Turn, please. Thank you. And Kenji, you head to the sky. Up and up and up. Okay, that's the highest you can go, so don't go any higher. And Yataka, just uh, walk out. No, don't, don't reserve for any kind. Just walk out of the Sky Ranger to be closer to the guys you want to mind control. And same thing for Uta here. You just head this way. Okay, and that's everyone. Next turn. So, 
show us yourselves in. Okay, why can we see there? I do not know. But doesn't really matter. We could. That's all we need. Okay, not that much activity happening. Uh, where is our guy who's supposed to see the aliens? Yeah, Bernard. Okay, you're already seeing one. Yes, that's good. Can you see the other one here? No. Uh, so it's just step out of the smoke. Then you should be able to see him. Yes, thank you. Uh, mind control people. Ataka, uh, step here and here and come over here. And now mind control this one, please. Thank you. And then mind control this one, please. Thank you. Oh, I can't pre pretty sure that they actually managed to do the mind control. So they're so good. So good. I love it. Okay, floater soldier, you're not seeing anything over here. That is good. Other floater soldier, your job is to go here. And okay, you're seeing someone. So, 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 where's Uta? Uta's over here. Uta, step this way. For more steps and try to mind control this one. Good job, Uta. So you floater soldier. <laughs> uh, Uta. Time to mind control some more. Mind control this one, please. Thank you. <gasps> this is so awesome. Ah, oh, I love it. It would be awesome to capture. Well, we, we did. We managed. Wait, wait, wait. This is the abductor. So this isn't actually the mutilation ship. What's the mutilation ship called then? Oh. Ah, <laughs> oh, this looks like a job for Kenji. Kenji, where are you at? You're there. <sighs> Launch the missile over here and uh, let's go down like over here and then here and straight to this one please. <laughs> oh. oh, this is so awesome. Oh. Yeah, we lost some money there for sure since uh, we can't get this stuff and sell it anymore, but... Just killing like five aliens right there. It's awesome. You probably need to check how many aliens Kenji has killed at some point just to see how. Oh, uh, just to know. I need to know it. Okay, so. Now the problem we have here is that uh, there is this one guy we have in mind control and we don't have enough mind control to do it. And I really don't want to use uh, these aliens to shoot him. So I'm just gonna have the tank be on the roof here safe from anything and uh, floater soldier. Do we think that that guy has enough for a reaction shot? Well let's see. We're just gonna have this guy scout out a bit. And I think we actually want to put you over here. Well, now that you got uh, shot, it doesn't really matter. Because what I wanted to do is put someone like you. Let's put you here. And you are here to get uh, your bait. We're hoping that this one will shoot you so that our guys who come from here don't get shot. Uta, you can't do anything this turn. Uh, Brett. Like, we can be pretty sure there's no one coming from here since we just uh, blasted there. But uh, I'm still gonna have you guys reserved for an auto shot. Everyone this way, please. Except, of course, you guys who start going. Where is that one alien? Okay, there. Right, we might be wanting to shoot him next turn. Okay, Itaka, you can't do anything. So, Sylvie, come here. And Otto, you come here. And uh, Bernard, you come here. And uh, wait, who's got the motion scanner? Clarence, Clarence, where are you? You, you are here. Okay, Clarence, just walk here, please. Right. 
tank, uh, head to the sky, and go here. So we can use the tanks to scout out these guys next turn, so we can mind control them some more. Mind controlling is so awesome! Oh, I'd completely forgotten how awesome mind controlling is, because, uh, like I said at the very beginning, I haven't played a full campaign in s many, many years. I've only played, like, you know, just a couple of missions that now and then, and when you play a couple of missions now and then, you don't get the mind control, of course, you never get it, because, uh, it's... Well, sometimes you can get it quite early if you get uh, lucky, quote-unquote, because uh, you're not that lucky if you get ethereals at the very beginning. But, uh, yeah, sometimes you... Sometimes that does happen, and uh, then you can get mind control very early on, which is, of course, super awesome. But, yeah, I, ha I don't even remember when was the last time I actually used mind control as much as I have used in this campaign. Oh, I love it! It's the best! Okay, floater soldier, go make sure there's no one here. There isn't anyone here. Okay, so come this way then. Alright, you're a floater. You can fly. I don't know if... Wait! Turning requires energy! That's weird. Uh, so tanks, 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 tanks. We need you to go check out where that one dude was. Over here. So come here. Okay, there he is. Uh, mind control people. Uta, Uta, we need you. So step. Oh, I might have stepped a little bit too. F yep, one step too far. Well, mind control this one. Oh, you failed! Of course, you're gonna fail now. Uh, Yataka, we need you to do this. To do this. Thank you, Yataka. So floater. Go check out if there is anyone in here. And, uh. Is there a hole here? There is, so fly up. And. You know, I think this is the first time we actually seen an abductor ship. And, you know, want to fly down, go into the fire. Uh. It's so funny. Clarence, I uh, used the mind control. Uh, it's, no, not my camera scanner. So there's some one six steps in front of you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so someone in this room. Right, uh, Clarence, you just stay there. Uta, come a bit closer. Okay, stay there. Brett, you need to save enough for an auto shot and come here. Sarah, you come here. Uh, just actually use all of your time and just get here. Okay, Sylvie. Come this way. And all of you other guys as well, just head here. Shuji, you too. Tank, uh, where's that guy? Our floater guy, man, there is our floater guy, man. So go here so that you can see it next turn. Just wait there. Uh, U-Tank. Come here. And go down. We need you to be able to see the that dude next turn. And Kenji, are you loaded? You're loaded. You don't need to do anything. Just stay there. And Itaka, you're done. Bernard, walk this way. Okay, and next turn. So there's a. Uh... Ah! Oh, okay, that was. Uh... That was actually bad. Because. How come we're seeing that one? Yeah, the reason why it's actually bad is because now we can't mind control it and uh, go inside safely. Can't... You can't see the alien here? What in the world? Okay, tank, you must be able to see it. Yes, okay. Mind control, dudes. Where are you? Well, we'll just click Yataka here. Yataka, mind control this one, please. Please, please, please. Where is it? It's here. 
Thank you, attacker. And floater, soldier, you're just gonna head towards the door. You're running out of energy, that is not very nice. Hmm. Because since I can use the floater to scout, I don't think I really want to sacrifice any of my own guys here. So we're just gonna go here. Let's think about this for a while. We're gonna go on a line like here. Yeah, we're just gonna put these guys right here. And Uta, you're gonna wait there to mind control. And Clarence, you're there to scan. Yeah, there's two guys somewhere there. Yeah, actually, Tank, we can use you to scout out this area to see if they decided to come down. Like, as long as you have more than 50 time units left, like you have now. How can we see that? There's, there has to be a hole over here. Okay, Uta! Nope. Oh, thank you for not going there, Tank. Uta, mind control this one. Thank you. It's a leader. And there's no one else in this room. Good to know. Floater leader, come here. Come. Oh, you're like close to panicking. That's nice. Okay, there's another one over here. So let's uh, mind control that one as well. Uta, mind control. <laughs> this is so fun! <laughs> uh, you know, I, I'm understanding why the Ethereums use mind control so much. <laughs> okay, Floater, you need to go check out this area, but... Uh, yeah, I don't think there's anyone in here. Nope, doesn't look like it. So it might be just these guys who are... Uh, left on this ship. So we're gonna leave you there. And uh, Shuji, come towards the door, please. And I will just keep reserving enough for an auto shot just cause uh, I'm worried, like, can't, if, if I suddenly start using all of my time units, then there's gonna be an alien that I haven't even seen anywhere. It's just been sitting around somewhere doing nothing and, and suddenly jumps up on us and kills us. Cause that's how it goes. Okay, Yataka, I don't think we need you anymore, tank. Yeah, you're exactly where you should be, Kenji. We're gonna not gonna need you. And Yataka, yeah, you and Clarence and Uta are the last ones here. So uh, let's just move you closer to here, maybe. And next turn. Okay, yeah, those guys that we're mind controlling are the only guys left here. So uh, let's shoot down down this one from here. Bernard, just take the shot, please. Oh, come on, Bernard. Okay, good job. And a tank should see that one. Yes. So we're gonna mind control it with Uta here. And of course it's successful because they're so good at mind control. We're gonna go find that one we left over here. Over here. Yes, and then we're gonna mind control that one with Yataka. Mind control, mind control. And of course it works, and then we're gonna have these guys just uh, come somewhere where we can shoot them easily. Like you go there, and this other floater, please come here. And go down, and uh, tank, get out of the way. And floater navigator, come here. So we're gonna have next turn. We're gonna have these guys shoot him, and then we're gonna have the tank go find the leader, and then we're gonna have these guys shoot it some more. Yep, you guys just shoot this one. Good job, Red. Right, and then tank 
go find the leader. We should be able to see it. Yes. So Uta, mind control it. <laughs> oh, this is so awesome! Like, ah, oh. ah, oh, not to, like, this is the time when I'm starting to feel that we are powerful. Like, before this, I've always thought that we were the underdogs here. But now, now I feel like we are overpowering these aliens easily. Right on! That had to be the last alien. Of course it was! That was so awesome! Oh yeah! 11 aliens killed, 12 corpses recovered. <laughs> not enough equipment! What in the world? How do we not have enough equipment? Well, first of all, I want to go check out how many aliens has... Uh, da -da -da -da. Well, it was Kenji, 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 where you at? There you at. 17 aliens, okay. That's not really that much. And uh, yeah, but I think we're gonna continue this. <laughs> this lowering of aliens in the future. I'm Uncle Cop, and this has been UFO Enemy Unknown. Goodbye, world. Thanks for watching. See you next time.